In this video, I will show you how to transfer crypto from Maxi to Bitfavo. First of all, I want to say, if you want to get started with Bitfavo with the best fees available, make sure to check out the link in the description down below to get started. So first, we need to go to Bitfavo and we need to search the specific crypto coin that we want to transfer from Maxi to Bitfavo. Let's take XRP, so Ripple for example. Let's search for XRP and let's tap on XRP. It is very important to note that um, both the um, the coin, so in this case Ripple, needs to be on both Bitfavo as well as Maxi. Most of the times this is the case, but um, you know it. You know it, the coin must be available on both exchanges. So if you check that, then go to uh, Ripple in this case, and then go to Deposit right there. Here you can see uh, a lot of information. So you, you see the asset balance, so how much you actually have in XRP, and you see deposit XRP. So you need to select a network to view your personal deposit wallet address. Then you step on Ripple because it's the only uh, option in, the, in this case. So Bitfavo only offers the specific um, coin network to transfer coins to. So uh, make sure the network you selected is the Ripple network. That's the only possible network. Using the wrong network may result in the loss of funds. And next you need to tap on uh, view wallet address. I have a, a document for you, which is linked down below and you can check out um, how to do this exactly. So first you need to check the supported coins. So like I said, it's very important that um, the crypto you want to transfer is, transfer is both supported on uh, Maxi as well as on Bitfavo. Like I said, most of the times this is the case, but sometimes um, it might be a case that it is listed on Maxi, but not on Bitfavo. So keep that in mind. Then you need to go to your Bitfavo account, select the cryptocurrency you want to transfer. Uh, in this case, we used XRP. Then navigate to the deposit section. And then you need to copy the deposit address uh, generated that for that specific cryptocurrency. So once we tapped on um, view wallet address you see a long code which you just can copy um, and that is a, a, the specific code you need to fill in with a maxi so basically um, yeah um, you need to copy that and also be sure to copy the the network um, based yeah the the, the uh, like the correct network so there are specific networks it is also just a code you need to uh, copy um, it's very easy and it's very straightforward, but you just need to copy this specific code which Bitfavo will, will uh, show to you when you tap on this. Okay, uh, and then once you copy all of that, all of those things, you can go to uh, Maxi. So you just need to log in. Then you need to go to Assets or Wallet, and then uh, you need to select the specific uh, cryptocurrency you want to transfer. So in this case, in our example, we used uh, XRP. So go to your XRP and then click on withdraw. Then paste the Bitfavo deposit address that we copied earlier. So the long code, and then you need to paste the network uh, code. So something like this, right? And you also need to paste that um, uh, to make the transfer complete. Then enter the amount you want to transfer. So how many of your XRP you want to transfer to Bitfavo. And then you need to confirm it uh, and yeah, complete, maybe complete security steps like two factor authentication. And then um, you just need to confirm it. So um, yeah, after you initiated the transfer from XE, you just need to wait uh, for the transaction to be processed on the blockchain. So you, you don't get, usually you don't see like a, a loading screen or how much time it takes. It usually just you, you can do that within a specific blockchain tracker, but not usually not on the exchange itself. As you can see, you can monitor the status of the transaction using a blockchain explorer. Maxi will provide a transaction ID of tracking. So once you tap on send or withdraw, you will get a specific ID, a tracking code, um, which uh, allows you to track the specific um, transaction. So to see where it is and where it's going to. You just need to paste that code right here, and then you can see the, then you can see the, the uh, you know the, yeah, specific status of the transaction, all right? Um, and now, um, yeah, once the transaction is confirmed, the funds will appear in your Bitfavo account, as in this case XRP. So very important tips. 
Um, double check the address, so make sure every letter is the same. If one letter is different, one digit is different, it, you know, uh, it, it will not come to you. So that's very important. So cryptocurrency transfers are irrelevant. Ir I can't pronounce that. <laughs> Um, but make sure the address you paste is correct uh, as well as network ne network fees be aware of the network fees involved which will be decreted uh, from your total as well as the processing time depending on the cryptocurrency and blockchain networks uh, congestion the transfer might take a few minutes to several hours so um, what I do recommend you is to send just a small amount like if you have let's say ten thousand dollars of X XRP in Maxi and you want to transfer that to Bitfavo, I recommend you to first send like ten dollars instead of ten thousand right away. And if the ten dollars arrived successfully, you can send the other nine thousand nine hundred and ninety dollars. Um, just yeah, make sure that it is safe and secure and without any surprises. So that is basically it. So um, yeah, if you have any questions, um, just ask them down below. Uh, I will leave this document uh, down below in the description as well as a link for Bitfavo to get started with Bitfavo um, for the best fees available. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was helpful, please subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.